To be standing here today in this moment with you has been a dream of mine since we began dating at 14. They say good things come to those who wait, and after 1,976 days from that day, this moment today has proven to be true. Oh, oh, my, my. We need a dress. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Kara, it's hard to believe that this day is finally here, one we've talked about since we were freshmen in high school, and there's no person I'd rather spend it with than you. You've always known how to make me laugh. When I try to think of all the things that I love about you, it's almost impossible for me to narrow it down to any one thing, because let's just be honest, you're perfect to me in every way. Just laugh. I don't know, I can't help but laugh. Ta-da! Look at you. It's a little chilly. Ah, oh, I'm stuck! Oh. <laughs> I can't reach, you gotta bend down. Love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast. It is not proud, it does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angry. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails. Everything's finally right. The dark made peace with the light. I look forward to the days that we get to spend together, whether it's going out to do stuff or just simply sitting at home doing absolutely nothing. I look forward to what our, whatever our future has in store for us, so let's go ahead and make it official, babe. I love you with all my heart. Get myself together. <laughs> Today, surrounded by our family and friends, I want to pledge my love to you forever. As your bride and best friend, I will spend every day trying my best to provide you with the same happiness I always have, knowing that you will be doing the same in return. Your kind and caring soul, your goals and aspirations and your drive to achieve them, the way you push me to achieve my own, and the comforting feeling I get when I'm around you are just a few reasons why I love you. Although it's easy to say that I love everything about you because I truly do. Together as husband and wife and best friends, with God's guidance, we are going to accomplish all that we've looked forward to and more. Marriage may not be easy, but loving you forever will be. You have and always will be worth the wait. I love you endlessly. By the power invested in me as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ and according to the laws of the state of Indiana, I now am proud to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.
I first met Caleb probably in the fourth or fifth grade, and after that beca we became great friends. I still remember riding the Caleb's grandparents the bale hay in the seventh grade. That was a good time. We were always up to something, most of the time probably something we weren't supposed to be doing. Then he met Kara, and I could tell that she was the one. You've heard the phrase, two peas in a pod, and that's exactly what Caleb and Kara are. Although I'm very sad for you guys moving so far away, I'm excited for this new chapter in your guys' lives. I cannot wait for you guys to move closer already because let's be honest, Kara, you're my only friend. 